Faxverse presents Rescue Dog's Strange Behavior Wakes Owner in the Middle of the Night. Before we get started, make sure you subscribe and click that notification bell so you can stay up to date with all our videos. Drew Smith, an engineer in San Diego, decided when he was 41 years old that he wanted to adopt a dog. He already had a specific breed in mind. His heart was set on adopting a golden retriever because they're known for their loyalty. But when he entered his local animal shelter in October 2015, Drew found that his heart wanted something quite different. The San Diego Department of Animal Services, located in Bonita, housed 216 different animals at the time Drew arrived, making it quite difficult for him to come to a decision. He may have entered the shelter looking for a golden retriever, but he found himself drawn instead to a little spaniel mix. The dog was two years old, 16 pounds, and didn't even have a name yet. Later, Drew admitted, There were other dogs that I was looking at. I almost didn't get them. But he couldn't resist that cute pup's face. Adding a pet into your life is a huge commitment and Drew decided to go back home and wait a couple days before making his decision. When he returned to the shelter, he still couldn't resist that little dog without a name. Drew later said to ABC News, No dog is perfect, but they can be perfect for you. He must have sensed there was something special about this dog without a name, because that day, he took the pup home with him. Little did he know, within a few months, his new dog would turn out to be more incredible than he could have imagined. Drew decided to name his new companion Carl, and within weeks, they were best friends. He took Carl out everywhere with him, including restaurants, even on vacations. Carl turned out to be a very calm and sweet little dog, and he even let Drew dress him up in adorable bow ties. He was friendly and relaxed with everyone that he met, and everyone who met him fell in love instantly. A few months later, though, his calm demeanor changed drastically. In late January of 2016, Carl seemed to have changed into a different dog. Before, Carl had rarely barked. In fact, Drew hadn't heard him bark at all in the first three weeks after adopting him. However, in late January, Carl began to bark suddenly and frantically. Drew could feel that something was wrong, but he couldn't place it. Then, on January 21st, Carl changed even more. He became visibly agitated and worried. His dog walker even noticed that Carl seemed different from usual, and for some reason, the dog seemed nervous about entering his apartment at the end of his walk. Drew was concerned, wondering what on earth could have happened to make his calm little dog act so differently. Because Carl was a rescue dog, it was possible he had endured some sort of trauma when he was younger. Could this trauma be affecting him suddenly? Or was it something else entirely? Was the poor little dog getting sick? Drew couldn't imagine what was causing his beloved dog so much trouble. On the night of January 22nd, Carl's behavior became even more extreme. He began to bark endlessly. Drew took him out on a walk that ended at 10 at night, but Carl didn't want to go back into the apartment. Drew did everything in his power to soothe his canine companion, and when they finally made it back into the apartment, it seemed like Carl had calmed down enough to go to bed. In the middle of the night, however, Drew was awoken by Carl's frantic behavior. Drew later explained in an interview that, quote, he didn't want to go to bed. He was barking and going crazy. Not only did Carl not want to go to bed, he also didn't seem to want Drew to fall asleep either. The dog kept licking Drew awake and barking at him, as if trying to keep his owner awake. Despite Carl's efforts, however, Drew did manage to fall asleep for a bit before he was reawoken by Carl. Drew woke up sleepily to Carl's barking, trying to figure out what was wrong with his dog, when he suddenly noticed his throat felt as though it were burning. Throughout the previous week, Drew had been experiencing random headaches. Though he didn't have any medical history to suggest why he had those headaches or why his throat was suddenly burning, Drew was becoming concerned. He was still tired, however, and decided to worry about his health in the morning. He reached for a glass of water from his nightstand and tried to go back to sleep, but Carl was having none of it. He kept barking until Drew was fully awake. That's when Drew noticed he smelled something odd. He got up to flip on the lights, and when he did, Carl's behavior suddenly made sense. Countless dogs can be trained to become service dogs who provide aid in a variety of ways. Some dogs can sense blood sugar levels and diabetes, and others can help their owners with anxiety and PTSD. Carl was never trained as a service dog, but it seemed he would stop at nothing to try and save his owner's life. When Drew finally turned on the lights in his apartment, he saw that his entire room had filled up with smoke. That's when his smoke alarms finally began to go off. Drew immediately grabbed his hero of a dog and raced outside the apartment to escape the fire. When the firefighters finally arrived to put out the blaze, Drew learned just how bad the situation was. The firefighters couldn't decipher exactly how the fire started, but they could confirm that the fire had been slowly smoldering for days. Even though the fire was too small at first for Drew to detect it, Carl's excellent nose must have realized what was wrong. Carl's odd behavior and hesitance to enter the apartment the night before finally made sense. In the aftermath, Drew was amazed by Carl's heroic act. Drew later wondered aloud in an interview with Fox 5, 
It's scary to think if he hadn't worked me up, like, what really could have happened? What ifs, you know? If Carl hadn't woken Drew up in time, the blaze could have spread even further before the alarms finally went off. The insidious fire had spread over a matter of days, and the only trace it left was Drew's mysterious headaches. It wasn't until Drew was able to actually see the smoke that he realized what was wrong. If Carl hadn't woken him up earlier, would Drew have gotten out in time? Dogs are able to detect smells 100,000 times more accurately than humans can, according to the United States Fire Administration. This is why Carl could sense the fire so much earlier than Drew or any other human could have. Still, Drew is amazed that Carl had the courage to try and save his owner along with himself. It truly displays just how strong the bond between Drew and Carl is. Even with Carl's early warning, by the time the firefighters were able to put out the fire, considerable damage had been dealt to Drew's apartment. But at the end of the day, Drew was simply happy that he and his dog both managed to escape the blaze completely unhurt. Drew now affectionately refers to his furry friend as Carl the Wonder Dog, and he's forever grateful to the pup for saving his life. Drew told ABC News in an interview, I try to do something and give him a better life, and in the process, he's given me a better life through being my companion, but also by saving my life. Long before Carl saved Drew's life, Drew already knew that he and Carl were the best of friends, but Carl's heroic actions only helped to prove just how close the two really are. Drew is certainly happy that he followed his heart and adopted little Carl, instead of the golden retriever he had been hoping for. If Drew hadn't chosen Carl as his loving companion, who knows what could have happened. Overall, Drew has learned that, when it comes to choosing an animal as your companion, it's best to choose with your heart rather than your head. Drew urges any person who is looking to adopt a pet, give them a chance. They may give you a second chance. Pets of all kinds, not just dogs, can prove to be just as faithful and heroic as Carl the Wonder Dog. Have you ever been helped out by a pet? It doesn't have to be as heroic as saving you from a fire. Tell us your story in the comments. And be sure to subscribe to Facts Verse for more videos.